Good afternoon, South Florida. I'm Christy Krueger. Here's a look at some of the stories making news for you today. Our Stanley Cup champions continuing to celebrate ahead of Sunday's victory parade. Hundreds of Panther fans lining the streets of Pompano Beach yesterday for a chance to meet a star player, Matthew Kachuk, at the right Raising Cane's restaurant. Meanwhile, crews have added a last minute touch to the event stage for Sunday's Parade of Champions. The route will begin at Rio Mar Street and head down to Southeast 5th Street. And be sure to tune in to Local 10 this Sunday starting at 11 o'clock. We're going to bring you live coverage of that parade from the comfort of your home. You can watch it from start to finish celebrating our Stanley Cup champs. And right now, police are searching for a suspected carjacker who took off with a baby in a car. BSO deputies telling us that woman got into a crash on Wednesday along West Commercial Boulevard and Northwest 9th Avenue. The suspect took advantage of the chaos and drove off in the woman's SUV with her baby in the back seat. The suspect is seen dropping that baby off on a sidewalk and taking off before eventually abandoning the vehicle. More video shows the crook entering a family dollar store where investigators say he used that woman's credit card to buy things. And here's one more look at that man. So if you have any information that could lead to an arrest, give Broward Crime Stoppers a call right away. That number 954-493-TIPS. You could get a reward. And a five-year-old little boy has died sadly after drowning in the backyard swimming pool in southwest Miami-Dade. That boy airlifted by fire rescue from a home at Southwest 168th Terrace and 149th Avenue. Sadly, despite medical efforts, he did not survive. Homicide detectives have taken over this investigation. And as breaking news happens, we have you covered both on air and online. You can head to local10.com for more local news coverage and updates all day long. Have a great day.